Um, let's try that. Build that all. Yeah, that's not it. Um, preferences, extended import, add new rule. Uh, for dot .og, use that one. Yep. And how does this work? Yeah, but it still uses, this uses the correct guy. Okay. Um, now I'm going to just export because that was the complaint. But we'll test that out. So I'm going to call it real org copy. And yeah, I'll replace it. Oh, and look at that. It's not slowing down. It's going really fast. And isn't that wonderful? All right, so I think we have a winner. Very quickly, I am going to, well, first I'm going to make a patch. I'm going to go to source. It's just source directory, I think. Yeah, it's, it's only source directory. So I'm going to do a SVN diff and put it in patches. Um, and call it, what should I call it? Libsyn file uh, PCM importer avoid og dot patch yeah and hey look I'm going to revert that here. I'm going to make again just to make sure I was testing the right part of the bug because I'm not I I don't I'm not confident that I was okay so now with the same preferences if I open real.og okay it goes to og vorbis so how do I get it to take the um, this guy Maybe do that. No. No, that should be unchecked. Okay. So. Did I build? Yeah, I did build. So open. Yeah, you can't pick og from this dialog for sure. How do you get og again? I can't remember. Dot og should try that. Yeah, that's what we want. Okay, dot og, try that. Hmm, that didn't work. Uh, did I reconfigure something? I'm pretty sure I did not reconfigure. Because why would I when I'm working on this book? Um, we can add another rule. Aha! Aha! The generic rule is what makes this happen. Okay, so I'm going to quit. Alright, so... It's an interesting bug. It gets lower towards the end of the file. Um, let me run it again to make sure things are set up. And I can just go to recent files, real og. Yep. Great. Um, so I'm going to apply the patch. Dash p0. I don't know if I think you don't need the p0, but I always type it. Oh, what was it called? Lib avoid. 
Ja. Don't tell me I didn't save it, because that would suck. It's not a lot, but I spent a lot of time writing those comments. You bastard. Ah, no. There we go. Yeah, you do need the best piezo, don't you? Okay. So make again. Wonderful audacity. All right. So here is the moment of truth. Boom! Importing OG files. Yeah. We're still using that funny setup. Okay, great. Uh, I'm gonna commit this because um, why not? I don't know why quitting segment creates a segmentation fault in, my, in the Linux box. That's something I might want to look into. Yep, we definitely don't want to do anything from here. I don't even know what those mean. I have no idea what that means in the make file. Uh, that's it from source. So what we want to commit is, oh no, my camera died. When we commit something, we look at the bug report. And in this case, ah, no, 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 this is how I commit. I'm so lazy. Yeah, I just go like this. Oh, is there no? Hmm. It'd be nice if you can go into the future. SVNCI M. Bug V11. PX. Yeah, PX, yep. Yeah. And Fix slow import export with og files or Linux builds that use system libsyn file. Is that a thorough description? Yep. We. Yep. Disables. Hog. Which isn't. Supported. In our local. Libs file. That's true right. I think that's true. That must be a configure option. I hope I don't get in trouble for this. I better check. Now I'm getting scared. It's always when you write the commit message. Uh, 
because we do use um, AUG files for compressed data. But I guess we use lib lib og vorbis for that. I want to double check. Yeah, I'll hold that for a little while. Let me look in the og block file. This is the only odd comment. Um, so let's look. We can also look in the config. That's another option. Yeah, actually, first I'm gonna look in the config. Because there is config history. More config.log. Alright, so the system version disable option checking with libsan file local, with lib preference local system, with config. Yeah, 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 yeah. It says nothing about AUG or whatever. Hmm, that's interesting. Once we get to the bottom... Oh, it doesn't show the list of the supported codecs. Well, that's too bad. I guess it's just an old version. Um, let me look at the change log. This is a pretty recent version. I mean, this is newer than Ubuntu 10.10. Uh, this version might have already fixed the stuff. Let's look at the top. No, but Eric's comment was around this time, so I don't think so. Yeah. It is the capital. It's uh the castro, the castro local. Hmm. I don't get it. Why wouldn't this bug appear in the local version? What's the spec file? 